Have you ever felt like you're growing, but the people around you just aren't keeping up? It happens. As you learn and change, your relationships might start feeling a little outdated, sort of like that old t-shirt that doesn't quite fit anymore. You need to understand that you're not the same person that you were last year. You're not the same person that you were last month. Hell, not even last week. Understand that you're always picking up new interests, maybe reading new books, maybe seeing the world in a different way, and of course, meeting new people. But the current people around you, you gotta look around and ask yourself, are they growing with you? Or do they somehow seem stuck? It's tough to realize that maybe a friend you shared everything with, or maybe a job that once excited you to the point where you couldn't wait to clock in, now starts to feel like it's holding you back. But to grow means you need to move forward and Sometimes that means moving on from people and experiences that don't grow with you. Friends right now, do they challenge you? Do they inspire you? Do they support you in your goals? If not, maybe it's because you're outgrowing them. I don't know. I do know that it's okay. I know that it's not about blaming them. It's about recognizing that you need people around you who also want to grow not only for themselves, but with you. You have to ask yourself, well, how do you go about it? First, you gotta take a look at your current relationships and decide which ones make you feel like you're thriving and, and which ones that just feel like dead weight. You gotta be honest with yourself, and that's the hardest part. And it's gonna hurt to admit that a longtime friend or a once beloved coworker at the job or even the job itself just doesn't fit your life anymore. But this is about your growth in your future. And if some relationships aren't helping you grow, you can't be afraid to recognize this and to approach these situations with both empathy and respect. And what do I mean by that? Well, maybe you realize it's time to have that heart-to-heart -heart conversation and start spending less time with certain people. You gotta face the truth sometimes that it might be time to say goodbye. And when you come to that realization, and whatever you choose to do, you got to make sure you, you do it with empathy, you do it with compassion, not only for yourself, but for them as well. Ending old relationships, it's not just about saying goodbye. It's about making room for new hellos, relationships, new friends, new colleagues, new experiences, new connections. It's time to experience people who understand who you are today and who you're trying to be tomorrow. These new relationships, Man, they can inspire, they can motivate you. They can help create the discipline you need to be your best. But you need to look around. You need to look around and you need to see who's climbing the same mountain as you. Because those are the people that you want on your squad. Those are the people you want to get to know. Understand, they're not your competition. They're your companions in this new chapter of your life. And as you align with these people, these people who match your, your current goals and, and your current motivations, you're going to feel even more inspired. You're going to feel happier. You're going to want to be the best version of yourself or yourself. Because understand that with this group, you're not just building acquaintances or even friendships. You're putting together a foundation on which your future successes and your future goals are built. Bottom line, growing up means becoming the best version of yourself and sometimes that means outgrowing the people you no longer share anything in common with understand that not everyone is meant to go to distance with you this isn't selfish thinking it's necessary for your personal growth feeling stuck and unsure if you're in the right company well look at who's around you are the folks that's supposed to be in your circle cheering you forward are they encouraging you focus and to put in the effort that you need to be the best version of yourself already talking shit behind your back to other people smiling in your face maybe casting a little doubt in your mind that maybe just maybe you're not meant to do this or that make your current circle a reflection of where you want to be and not where you've been and if you feel that we got some videos on personal growth making tough choices and building lasting relationships remember this growing up sometimes means growing apart and that's all i gotta say until next time we chat remember to live authentically and always keep it real